Declaring your political affiliations or stance at this particular point in time in Ghana's um, situation or in, in the country called Ghana is one of the most dicey and difficult decisions to take because you never know where it will come back to hunt you or bite you in the ass, especially when we are in an election year, especially when the whole country would be going to the polls come 7th December, especially when we have few months for the country to decide which political party is going to be in governance or is going to be in government to lead the country to the promised land. This is the story of how Ejaku walked off stage when he was, during his performance, he was confronted by some disappointed party members of the same party he's supporting or the people from the opposition. I have the full gist for you. My name is Roland Amati. This is the podcast with me live on Roland Report. You're welcome. If you're watching or you're listening for the first time, don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to share this content, obviously, with others so they can also enjoy what you're enjoying on this platform. And hey, I do this with you. So as much as I am doing the talking, you can also be doing your contribution or be bringing your contributions in the comment section. Let me hear from you right there and then what you think about Ejako's stance and the confrontation of him abandoning his performance but don't forget this show is also sponsored by Ghana's number one ride hailing app Shagzi go on your google play store your app store download the app today as a driver just sign up with just 20 Ghana cities and you pay no commission to anybody you're entitled to 12 hours which can last for about a whole week whatever you earn whatever you get is for you you pay no commission to anybody and as a rider just sign up for free wherever you'd want to go at any point in time just place your ride just order your ride and swift and convenience as well as safety is also assured so just order your ride today and know that shagzi it is time to ride let's go straight into today's matter open and close as quickly as possible so yes like i said the jacko is in the news and it is about you know as much as he is an actor He's also a musician as well, where he also has a band or he owns a band that usually they go around performing gigs and all of that. So with one of these gigs, Ejako was just built to perform during one of the funerals, of course, that if you're looking for one of the people that performs in recent times, especially during funerals, Ejako is definitely one of them. So as part of performing or delivering his service as a musician, obviously he was confronted by some of these um disappointed party members or people from the opposition party now who are displeased with the political affiliation of Ejako. So whilst Ejako was performing, people were shouting, Mahama, 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 Mahama. Of which Ejako was like, no, there's a huge disrespect to me as a person or even to the people that are working. Because we all have different political ideologies, different political affiliations. Yet when you come into my band, we have people who are NDC, we have people who belong to different political parties. Yet, when it comes to the work, we are working. So why won't you allow me to work? Then Ijaku, out of anger, dropped the mic and just left in the middle of his performance. So many people have spoken against it. So many people are saying, yes, he's right. Charlie, this guy is there not for a political campaign, but to deliver a performance. Yet, you guys are distracting. But some people are also saying, no, Charlie... The politics, they will do them everywhere. So the moment you declare your political affiliations, wherever you stand, we will give it to you as soon as you come. But I don't know what you think, but let's go watch the video. When we come back, you share your views in the comments. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, come on, come on. 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 Come on, come on.
The thing there, whether you vex or not, the Soloku will definitely go on because people have paid huge sums of money to get themselves entertained like during the particular function. So whether you drop the mic or not, the work must still go on. But then, what do you make of Ejako's gesture? To me, some people think that, yes, Ejako intermittently, most during his performances, mostly drops one or two lines as far as his political affiliations are concerned. This is not the first time. There's been so many instances whereby he's built to perform. And in the middle of the performance, he breaks to give reasons why you should vote for his political party or any other political party. So why is it that when you're on the same grounds of which people think that, oh, there's the likelihood that you'll be doing some of these things, decide to come at you with also their political how do you call it campaigns and all of that or political truths as some people may call it but then others are also of the view charlie he is there to render a specific service which is music he is there as a musician and not even a politician he is there as a musician and not to give political sermons and all of that so why don't you spare him and let him deliver and maybe when you catch him on that political grounds then you can give him your peace of mind or you can give him a dose of his own pill or cake but then this is what some people are saying i don't know what you think about it was a jacko right to have abandoned the performance or you think he maybe overreacted that oh this is something that he should get used to by now because yes the moment you belong to any other political party know that the other people from the opposition will definitely get or come at you let me hear from you let me know what you think because as far as we are concerned, Ejako is not the only celebrity that has shown his political affiliation. So some people are saying, Charlie, by this time there, you should get used to it that, yes, even in your private quarters, people will still come at you. Let me hear from you. Let me know what you think. My name is Roland Amati. Until then, I'll see you when I see you. Peace. Bye-bye. Hey! Aye! Aye!